my name is Nora, and I'm going to read you 100 Reasons Why I'm Not Taking a Bath by Stacey McNulty, illustrated by Joy A. Bath time! No way! I'll give you a reason. I'll give you 101 reasons. I'm not dirty. I'm allergic to water, to soap, to shampoo, to tile floors. My sensitive skin needs blue soap, and you keep buying green soap. Bubbles could get in my nose, my mouth, eyes, my eyes, my ears, my brain. Baths are too wet, and water makes my fingers wrinkle, and my toes, and my butt. At least I think it does. I'm not as dirty as Sam, who lost when he played mud tag. Or as Joe, who came in last when he rolled down the dandelion hill. Or we, who got stuck in the swan tunnel during the obstacle course. And none of my friends have to take baths. I'll clean myself like a cat. The dog only takes a bath like twice a year. I think I could fit in this bird bath. The sprinkler would be faster. You should clean the car instead. Instead, I don't have bird poop on me. I'll rise off in that puddle. But I don't smell as bad as this, or this, or this, or this. by attack while I'm in a in the bath or there might be a meteor shower or the sun might burn out or a comet might crash into our neighborhood or the moon might fall out of orbit besides I can find my arm floaties my arm floaties I need my arm floaties and goggles and a scuba tape and a surfboard and a coon fine I just need my bike can't take a bath on an empty stomach. I need a cupcake or a cookie or a lollipop. Just one lick of lollipop, then I can have a carrot stick. I need to wait 30 minutes after eating before I can get into the water. I mean 30 hours. I'll, I'll only take a bath in the sink or a dishwasher. Look, I have a self-cleaning button like the oven. I took a bath yesterday. Then it was the day before. Then it was the day before. Before the day before. I'll take a bath tomorrow. I'll take three, five, ten. That's my final offer. I'm not dirty. That's a freckle. And so is that. And that's a whole town of freckles. Hey, look, a clean spot. I'll just clean up with that hand sanitizer and an air refreshener. That is not going to work. I haven't finished my puzzle or my clay vase in the shape of a volcano or my finger paint portrait of the family or my model of the White House made of macaroni or my drawing of our house at night. A bath won't help. This is permanent marker. Most household accidents happen in the bathroom. Scientific fact. Scientific fact. Bath kill trees. Scientific fact. A kid in Texas turned a prune after taking a bath. Scientific fact. I am not dirty. This floor is dirty. And this chimney. And this coffee table. Every time I turn around, I find something dirtier than me. I don't understand why you want to, me to take a bath. It's not your birthday. 
We're not going to be on TV, are we? The president isn't coming over. I'll take a bath before I get married, and I'm never getting married. He is getting married, and he is going to take a bath before he gets married. Please don't make me go in there. Monsters live in the drain. Swami so hearing monsters. Packed with gaming nightmares about waterfalls. I've seen an invisible crocodile in the tub. I mean, I've heard an invisible crocodile in the tub. Ghosts hunt the soap dish. Dragons live behind the towel rack. Did you hear that? I think it was lightning. All the towels are dirty. The dog ate the washcloths. My rubber went and used all the shampoo to make his lagoon. The soap ran away to Antarctica. I'll be your best friend. I'll give you my dessert forever. I'll clean your room. Not my room. That's a mess. I said, your room. Okay, name your price. And reason number 101. I'm not dirty. What do you mean? I already used that one. And what do you mean? That's only 88. You've actually been counting. I don't want to. 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 Time to get out. I'm not getting out. And I'll give you 102 reasons why. Dan, I hope you enjoyed your book, 100 Reasons Why I'm Not Taking a Bath. Bye.